Hello, this is Simon Chilambo here. I would like to thank everyone that sent me messages of uh, love and uh, well wishes on my 60th birthday today, Monday, 8th June 2020. It's been a great day, uh, celebrated um, yeah, yeah, in accordance with uh, the social uh, conditions uh, we have uh, during this uh, time of the coronavirus, uh, COVID-19. As I said, a new face, another 60 years. I would like to thank uh, everyone that's been with me on this journey from the beginning in South Africa to Norway today via Lesotho uh, and Zambia. I've lived in Norway just a little over half of my life. I came to Norway by accident and uh, it was by accident that I stayed in Norway also. I came as a student, I've said that many times in various forums and uh, but uh, I started to teach karate working with children and youth and um, it was a great experience that did something to my paternal instincts and before I knew it you know I, I was stuck here you know out of um, the effect uh, this powerful effect uh, working with children here did um, with my paternal instincts and I started um, rocking and rolling with the children's um, I don't know, aunties and cousins, sisters, etc., etc. You know, and uh, and uh, basically, I fell in love, uh, and then uh, I stayed because I hadn't uh, originally intended to, to come and stay in Norway. Uh, I made uh, many practical uh, mistakes in relation to you know, bureaucracy. And uh, I overlooked uh, yeah, many things. I mean, I, mean, I wasn't gonna stay here, you know, so. Um, but when I, when it became apparent, you know, that you know, I, I was stuck here, uh, I had to start uh, things I knew and a lot of time, you know, had gone and uh, so um, I missed out on uh, a lot of um, opportunities uh, and, um, uh, uh, it comes to you know academic and professional growth but um, I'm not complaining um, there's no regrets uh, I did what I had to do and um, I've had a great time uh, I'm grateful to Norway for having given me the opportunity um, to be here and do things that I have done you know, the good things that I've done. I made a few mistakes here and there and got burnt uh, for that. And um, maybe that's just as it should have been. Um, but um, um, I am happy and, you know, uh, I was raised, you know, to pay very willingly, you know, the price for the mistakes I made, for the mistakes I make. Yeah. So the burnings that I've had for the mistakes I've made in Norway, it is just as it should be. But on the whole, Norway has been very, very good to me. Norway is still very good to me. And uh, I'm going to be here uh, till the very end, you know, who knows? I am not going to teach karate uh, again, at least uh, not at the same level that I've done before. I still have, uh, you know, visions, uh, dreams, you know, ambitions of uh, opening a school, uh, a private dojo, uh, sometime uh, in the future, but. Um, I will um, work 
with uh, young people who aspire to be teachers of karate that i would love very much to do in the future and uh, we see how it goes uh, the next 60 years are going to be great so um, i'm going to do something that uh, i have never known how to do and that is to ask for help and i guess some things do get better with age but um, i have um, my books uh, i miss uh, you know three of uh, the six books that i have written um, but uh, i have um, a request uh, to make and uh, that is uh, now that i'm 60 years old and i have another 60 years uh, to live wouldn't it be fun if we could uh, sell or buy 60,000 of my books during the course of the coming year so um, if anybody wants to give me a present I uh, humbly request that they buy one at least one of my books